Do you have problems modeling creature anatomy, both humanoid and animal-like? Then I welcome you to Nextwood Education's Orc Rider and Bull Creature Creation in ZBrush course. My name is Nico and I'm a 3D character artist for games for about 10 years now. Currently I work in one of the most famous game companies, Gameloft. In this course we will make two creatures, one orc and one bull-like creature which the orc is riding with all the armors and belts and stuff and everything will be real time, everything will be without speed ups and time lapses, completely real time. And by the end of this course you will be able to model a high poly detailed creatures, render them, poly paint them and pose them from start to finish in ZBrush. We will start by spending 30 minutes to customize our workflow in ZBrush so we could work much faster and efficient. Then we will make the head of our orc where I'll explain what you should watch for in a humanoid creature head modeling. Then we will make the hair, teeth and eyes from scratch. After that, we will make the muscular orc body again from sphere following our concept. After we are done with the orc body, we will start making the bull's creature's head, eyes and teeth. We will then make the bull body following some references from internet. After that, we will continue by making 3D sketch of the bull armors, belts and rings to get their correct placement. We will do that for the orc too. This is a pretty important stage, in the end of which we will have a very good idea how our model will look when it's finished. Then, it will be time to start extracting belts, armors, gloves and boots. We will also make a brush, which will make the placement of all those small metal parts like belt buckles, caps and rings very easy and fast. After that, we will start refining all those things that we have made, add thickness and details. At the end of this stage, the model will start to look pretty good. Then, it will be time to do the weapon of our orc, the big battle axe, and add it to the scene. Then, we'll learn how to make materials like metal and leather, which will increase the believability of our creatures. Once we are happy with the overall look of our orc rider, I will show you how to make good pose with Transpose Master in ZBrush. Finally, we'll make the render passes in ZBrush and combine them in Photoshop to achieve the best possible look for our sculpt. I have designed this course for intermediate 3D modeling students who want to model beautiful looking production ready creatures for games but they struggle to get it because they don't find the tutorial which is step by step, no fast forward, no skip and coming from a production artist who is doing this for years. The course is also for artists who want to speed up their workflow in ZBrush and improve their skill in making creature anatomy, weapons, armors and accessories. This course is not designed for absolute ZBrush beginners, so I expect you to have some sort of ZBrush experience. But intermediate ZBrush users and even professionals could learn a lot from the techniques and workflow I show in this course. There is a 30 day money back guarantee, so there isn't any risk to enroll in this course. So if you want to model production ready creatures, enroll now and take your skills to the next level. Don't forget that investing in yourself will pay for the rest of your life. So see you in the next video of the course.